control. The two men, both ex-fighter pilots in their early 40s, only found out they would be on the mission a few hours before the flights. They were picked from a short list of six, all vying for the prestigious title of Yu Hang Yuan, or Traveller of the Universe. Premier Wen Jiabao was in Jiuquan to witness the event, along with former chief executive Tung Chiwa and China's first astronaut, Yang Li Wei. Wen praised the astronauts' achievements, saying they've shown the Chinese people have the will and the confidence to accomplish scientific breakthroughs. President Hu Jintao also viewed the liftoff, but from the command center in Beijing. Hundreds of people gathered at the main train station in the capital to watch the launch on a giant screen. I feel this is a proud moment not only for China, but for all Chinese people and mankind, said this construction worker. The astronauts will carry out various tests and experiments during the mission, and if all goes to plan, they will return to Earth on Monday with a landing in the remote region of Inner Mongolia. Well, the families of the astronauts were relieved and delighted with this morning's launch. They held celebrations in their hometowns. In Fei Junlong's native Jiangsu province, his parents were joined by relatives in praying for his safe mission. Fei's old friend said space travel had been his lifelong passion, and the whole town is delighted at his success. Here in Hong Kong, many watched the launch live on television. As Amri Sim reports, the event touched all corners of society. Hong Kong was buzzing with excitement at the news that the mainland had successfully launched its second manned space mission. Many primary and secondary schools around the city tuned in to watch the big event live on television this morning. Students and teachers shared in the excitement as Shenzhou 6 roared into space. On the streets of the city, there was a sense of pride. It's really quite exciting because we, we, can, we can do something that others can do. Just, uh... Great glory for the China. Hong Kong University professor Jason Pun explained why the mission is so important. I guess the main significance of the Shenzhou 6 mission is that it demonstrated that the, the Shenzhou 5 is not a fluke. Pun also said the launch demonstrates China's coming of age as a space power, and he expects the mission to pave the way for a future Chinese space station, as well as an expedition to the moon. There was another big event today, Donald Jung's first policy speech as our chief. Mm。那麼三十五度可能。不過,佢話一切仍然有待官方公佈。無線電視記者類並權報導。神州六號係喺今早嘅九點正升空,由方東升喺酒泉衛星發射中心報導。三、二、一、開。起飛。起飛。神州六號太空船由長征二號F火箭推動下,在本港時間上晝九點正,在酒泉衛星發射中心升空。